Hey guys, just a warning, the viewing of this video may cause excess saliva, stomach grumbles and bouts of irritation slash joy. So ever since starting this series, one of the most requested topics you guys have been asking for is Korean street food. So in today's episode, I decided to take you around with a special guest to see some of the huge variety of street foods that are available in Seoul. And of course, get chatting with some locals and visiting foreigners. So when you're ready, let's munch right into it. Hey guys, it's Jen and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Streets of Seoul where I show you guys the streets of Seoul. And today we've listened to your requests about street food in Korea. And it's really cold as well, which is perfect for eating street food. There's heaps of stuff behind us already. But today I have a special guest who's going to join me. And he's someone that I've known for a while in Korea. We've worked together. He's an actor, model, singer. He's a dad as well. And he's here right now. Sir. Hello everyone. Joey, do you want to introduce yourself? I would much rather just go check out the food if that's okay with you. That is very rude of you. <laughs> Why don't I go just smell the food? I know you're hungry. You know, maybe naturally I can tell you more about myself. I perform better with a full stomach. So. Oh, that's Sound good? As long as my special guest is happy, right? Joey and I actually worked together on a TV show for one year, so fond memories of working together, and I let him choose the first dish of the day. No, there's, it's squid. Oh, okay. This is the first time. Is that how you hold your chopsticks? Why, is it wrong? <laughs> I'm, whatever, I'm self-taught. Oh, masikita. It's got like a bit of chili sauce. It's mm. What do you think of it? Uh, I think it's really good. It's it has a lot of flavor. It's not oily either. It's like it doesn't have that sort of greasy feeling. It's very clean. Yeah, it feels before. really clean. Now we are at the chili hot dog, Jijun Big Burger. Oh, it's warm. Cheers. Look, it comes in a cup. It's so cute. It's a very simple hot dog, but the the meat itself is actually really nice and savory. Yeah. And it's got bacon. It's very chill, a little bit chilly. So we're watching how he makes the takoyaki. I've never seen this before. It's so shingye. 주로 학생들이 많이 오나요? 그렇죠. 평일은 주로 학생이고요. 주말에는 이제 외부에서 오는 커플들이나 젊은이들. It's a good couple couple eating food, like you mentioned. Like yeah. The setup is nice. Like we put it in Gangjang Shijang before. Ah, we did, yeah. Can you feel a little plate? That's something you need to know that when you eat takoyaki, it's probably better to like just wait a minute. That being said, I'm still gonna eat it quickly. And he's probably regretting doing this just about now. Joey, you okay? Alright, can I chun chun him over? And chun go back. Chun chun. We're using a lot of cognish today. If you like potato and you like french fries, this is the one for you. <laughs> yeah, it's not the most attractive thing to be holding. Like, they, girls might not want to. You know what I mean? Mm. But it's really good. It's really good. Yeah, it's one of my favorites. Mm. This particular place reminds me of Myeongdong. In front of uh, some of the shopping centers, they have takboki. The chicken, that's well, old, not old dang. What is, what is that called? Omo. Omo. This is really hard to eat though if you have a small mouth. But well, are you trying to take my yeah, food? Yeah. <laughs> we bumped into these two people who um, were eating their food. And so we've got this couple here who are here on a date. He's a student and um, he comes here to study. My name is Yi Shin -e. uh, English name is Heiju. Do you come here a lot? I just came here. 인터넷으로 찾아보고 왔는데요. 여기 먹을 거 진짜 많아요. 데이트 할 만한 곳인 것 같아요. 저. 일단 싸고 네. 맛있고 사람들이 많이 올 만한 거. 추운 거 빼고 좋아요. <웃음> <웃음> 저희 여기는 거의 한 달에 한두 번 정도 오는데 길거리 음식들이 되게 많이 맛있, 맛있어요. 뭐 시켰어요? 쌀국수요. 맛있어요? 네, 아, 되게 따뜻하고 적성 요리인데 되게 맛있는 것 같아요. 어, 이게 타코야키. 타코야키. 이거 처음 먹어봐요. 아, really? 제가 항상 먹고 싶었는데. <웃음> 네. 사람이 너무 많아서 시간이 아까워서 안 먹고 있었는데 먹어도 돼요 지금? 
Yeah, of course. <웃음> 다음에 또 사먹을 것 같아요, 맛있어서. 음, 짜레나 치즈 닭꼬치를 먹었는데요. 진짜 저 뜨끈뜨끈하고 <웃음> 닭꼬치에서 피자 맛 나요. 오, 맛있다. 맛있었어요? 추천할 메뉴. 완전 추천. 추천할 곳 있어요, 노량진에는. 닭꼬치 같은 거 되게 좋아하고 컵밥도 다 되게 엄청 좋아하는 거 같아요. 컵밥이랑 길거리 핫도그들도 맛있고 일단 호떡 파는데 호떡. 호떡. 길거리 에잇 호떡. 저기 장사 되게 잘 돼요. 외국인들한테 혹시 어떤 것을 추천할 것 같아요? 김치 볶음밥이요. 조금 매워요. 아, 매콤해도 완전 중독성 있어요. 중고구마. 네. 네. 맛있어. 아. 호떡. 추울 때 먹으면 따끈따끈하니까. 뭐 다른 것도 먹어야 돼요? 아니면 이것만 먹어요? 여기 다 여기 있는 거다 먹을 거예요. 진짜기. <웃음> 여자친구분이 되게 행복해 하시는 네. 것 같아요. <웃음> 여기 자주 오셔야 될것 같은데. 먹을 걸좀잘 밝혀. <웃음> What do you thought so far in this place? Uh, I think it's pretty cool. I like that it's organized. The yeah. food is different. The preparation is there's there's uh -huh. more to it here. Yeah, but they've recently just developed it and made it super clean. So a lot of people come here after they're studying or while they're studying because a lot of students are here yeah. and they come on dates. First food I ever tried were uh, fish shaped red bean uh, red bean cakes. And they're shaped like a fish. Yeah. Did you like it? Yeah, and I loved it. I was like, okay, this is great. And then it just became it, it became part of my life. I would go to go to work and grab it in the morning. Okay. Well, if you come to Korea, you have to come check out Doryeonjin Market. But there are also other markets you can search for online, and every place has a different atmosphere and feel to it. So. So next, we moved to Dongno for more of the traditional vibe of Korean street food. Oppa joined us here too, but he didn't want to come out on camera. It was also starting to get really cold. So as you can see, I'm not sure if it's showing in the camera, but we're inside these little red kind of tents. Yeah. This is called pojang matcha, pocha, and it's a little bit more of the real traditional Korean style street food. So yeah, we're eating tteokbokki now, but there's a lot of other really traditional Korean foods like the all the tteokim, like the fried foods, and we're gonna go in and show you guys some of these foods. It's like rice cake that has chili sauce over it, so you gotta be able to eat chili, but it's definitely something you have to try when you come to Korea. And of course, the winter must try. Okay, you have to be really careful not to burn yourself because it's super hot. Super, super hot. It's like boiling. Odeng soup. Cheers! Cheers. So the running theme here is that everything is really hot, but so flavorful. I like how like everything sort of balances out if you really want to, like you don't necessarily have to. Ah, uh, okay. This is, this is the stuff I crave. Mm. Like the simple stuff, like okay. mm. just the easy stuff. Nice stuff. Mm. Okay, so what is this? Hotdog. It's not hotdog. 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 It's just. Ah, a, it's a. Okay, it's cut. A, it's a, <laughs> this one's more snacky. It's not like necessarily sad, um, filling. You go on the ane pat pizza. Five of them for just ten won. Five ten won? Oh, this is nice though. All right, so we just got some chicken because how can you have a street food segment in Korea without chicken. fried chicken? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Korean fried chicken is probably the best in the world, in my opinion. Remember we we tried. Uh, Kirim tok, kirim tok, kirim tok bokki. Yeah, kirim tok bokki. Right. That was so nice. And as the night went on, we just kept eating and eating. It probably didn't help that it was freezing cold. But we did bump into this lovely bunch of people who rescued us from our food slum. Okay, so we were Joe and I were just chilling at the pocha, and we bumped into these new friends of ours. So we'll just get you guys to introduce yourselves and why you're in Korea and what you're doing with this food and beer. Mati from Norway, and I'm here just for traveling and looking for work if I can find. Hi, doing. I'm Atib. Just arrived here in the past three days, trying out the street food, seeing how the food and culture is. So far, everything's awesome. So far, beer can't complain. I love his accent. My name is Ernesto, and I'm from Mexico. I'm I already came here a few hours ago. And hello, my name is uh, Joey, you already know me. I'm gonna ask them some questions now. So we just uh, all together enjoyed that chicken. So let's first, first things first, talk about that chicken experience. Everybody's first time, I think. No, no, I've had it many times. That's oh, really? I recommend that. Oh, ah, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I think the chicken was pretty good. I'm first time trying it. I've had a few of the other street foods. I think it's probably up there, one of my favorites so far. What about the whole street food? 
concept. Do you have that back? The concept of street food here is very attractive and it's something that most people look forward to. And it's cheap as well, so it's affordable. And you're drinking a beer on the street, which is <laughs> not so bad. And it's legal, no problem. Yeah, no, bonus. If you ever come into Seoul, get a beer, you can drink out in public. <laughs> a plus. For me, it's one of my first meals in Korea and it's pretty good. One of his best meals and it's street food. Yeah. Awesome. So these tents, have you ever seen it before? Were you aware of this kind of thing being here? Or are you having a culture shock right now? It kind of looks a bit intimidating because it's quite small and compact and it kind of seems like it's a closed off area. You mostly find at the tents there's a few seats where you can sit down to have meals but you're kind of a bit wary whether you can actually go inside or whether people understand what you want. Have you been there before? Uh, sure, Jin market. It's famous for having a fish market, an outdoor fish market. So if you want to go check out street food, that's that's a good place to try out as well. And there's also Gwangjang Shijang that we've been to. Do you know any other good places I mean, Myeongdong is, is, is full of street food. Myeongdong. Um, anywhere, anywhere near the, near uh, universities, I think you're guaranteed to get some really good street food. Daeangno, so Hewa. Can you guys all eat chili? Yeah, spicy food in general is my favorite actually. I tolerate hot foods. I find that quite difficult. Coming here, I've had to try and open myself to that because that's going to limit the amount of foods I can eat, like yeah. tteokbokki. I might not <laughs> like it most of the time. But it tastes good, so that helps. You build up your tolerance for chili food. Yeah. And then you'll get addicted one day. <laughs> Mexico, you eat spicy food? Yeah, Mexico is pretty, pretty much similar. Also, here in Korea, they have uh, beans. Beans? It's pretty much similar. There's actually lots of really good Mexican food in Korea, too. Eat the eat freedom. <laughs> I have to go check out Itaewon. You've been here a bit longer. Is there one street food that you would recommend that someone should try? If they uh, well, this is my favorite actually. To be oh, honest. Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. A lot of my subscribers are foreigners who want to come to Korea as well. Do you have any like tips or or any advice? I talk with the local people because they're really nice. It's okay to ask someone for help or if you're going to a restaurant and you don't know how to eat something like Korean barbecue but people are willing to help people are polite and friendly and I think that's a massive trait about Koreans is that they're willing to help and you just got to put your foot out there and actually have that initiative and ask. Atib was actually telling me that he watched my videos before he moved to Korea when he was preparing to come here so I'm so glad that some people are watching and getting some help from these videos so yeah. it's so cool that we got to meet at yeah, the chicken like, place. Yeah, like, <laughs> as I looked around and I noticed oh she kind of looks familiar and then I heard her speaking a bit of Korean. Oh yeah she's one of the people I'm subscribed to. Oh, so sweet. Okay anyway thank you so much for the time and it's really cold so go inside and get warm and get some good food. Thanks for the time. Thanks guys. So although we weren't able to show you every kind of street food in Seoul, hopefully this video has made you just hungry enough to want to come and try it for yourself. Please give a thumbs up to my team Joey, Orpa and I for making this video just for you guys in the negative temperatures. Also let me know in the comments below what food you would want to try the most from this video and why to enter into a surprise giveaway to be announced in one of my last videos for the year. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Street Food here in Korea. It's been super fun. Thank you, Joey, as always. Thank for you for having awesome. me. I really enjoyed being here. I got to eat food. I got to see you. <laughs> I got to meet your husband. So oh, it's been yeah. a lot of fun. And you can go and follow him over on his own Instagram and social media to see what he's been up to here in Korea. Thank you so much, everybody, as well, who's Pinky and everyone. We'll buzz here as well. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And any requests for future episodes, leave it down in the comments below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye! Bye! I know you're just pretending it's probably burning your mouth. I know. Oh, since that? You keep talking and I'll, I'll just eat it, okay? I'm not your boy. This is not your boy. This is not your boy. <laughs> you know, so I'm still talking to you. Okay, cut! It, cut. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's chopped off like, your fingers in here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so we've now moved on to Idong, the second part. Uh, Idong? Idong means move. We now Idong. Jongno oh. <laughs> is... Uh, <laughs> My name is Peter. Peter! Oh, Peter! You I, I, I just I, made it now. Just now. <laughs> Am I gonna feel comfortable there as well? <laughs> <laughs>
Had some drunk friends coming over. Kori, what about you? Mais is a takoyaki. Really like. Takoyaki, takoyaki, I like it. Yeah, takoyaki, I like it. Oh, Have fun. Good luck. Bye. 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 Bye.